Today we're going to learn how to um, put headers on a table. So what we need to do is scroll down in our document till we find a table. Here's a table for us to use. I won't just click anywhere in the table. You can click on the little double arrow, triple. The arrows up here in the corner, or you just can click anywhere in the table. And what that's going to do is going to cause these two new tabs to show up underneath table tools. We're going to actually click on the design tab and go over here to the table style options. And what we want is a header row. Um, we this table is really a small table. It does not have banded rows or banded columns. Usually header rows is the only thing that you need checked because most of the time you don't we're not using other things that you can use in these table styles. Okay and then we're going to go up to the top where it says layout and we're going to make sure we're going to click on this repeat header rows. You see how it's gray it's not gray. It's gray, not gray. So when it's gray, that means we've chosen it. It, it should have um, header rows repeating onto the next page. So see by here is our header rows. And over here, I can't highlight these because they're automatically coming over from the other side. So if I did something to this one like made the text red. You can see right here it, it turned the text red. So that's all it is to making header rows and all tables should have them. If you have any questions just email me. Thank you.